Hello guys, this is Ahmad Rabi from English Fit and in this video I'm going to help you improve your English vocabulary. Actually in this lesson we're going to teach you some vocabularies you can use instead of very. These vocabularies are very important and if you want to add some color to your writing and speaking you'd better learn these vocabularies. So let's get started. So instead of saying very big it's better to say huge. Huge is something that is very big. Okay. My friend Marshall, he has a huge stomach. He looks like a pregnant woman. I always tell him that he should go on a diet and lose some weight. So guys, don't eat a lot of food to make it this huge stomach. <laughs> Instead of saying very tasty, it's better to say delicious. Delicious. So the stress is on the second part. Delicious. So delicious is something that is very tasty and yummy. My sister always makes delicious cupcakes. I really love them. I'm crazy about these cupcakes. We can use delicious not just for food, but also for other things. For example, I enjoyed that delicious view. So delicious here doesn't mean tasty. It means lovely and pleasant. Yeah. Instead of saying very angry, it's better to say furious. Yes. Furious, which means very angry. When my students speak languages other than English in the class, I become furious. You know, guys, sometimes I'm a dictator in the class. I force my students to speak English in the class. Yeah. Instead of saying very scared, it's better to say terrified. Yeah, terrified. Terrified means very scared. Last night I watched a horror movie and I was terrified. I think I should stop watching horror movies. I may have some nightmares. Yeah. Instead of saying very interesting, it's better to say fascinating. Fascinating, which means very interesting. I went to the cinema with my friends two weeks ago and I found the whole movie fascinating. It was really interesting. There is a really nice point here, guys. Some people do not understand the difference between movie theater or cinema. You know, uh, American people usually say movie theater. They watch movies in movie theater or the short form is theater. Theater is an American spelling of theater. But British people, they watch films in cinema. So this is a difference between movie theater and cinema. And instead of saying very surprised, it's better to say amazed. Amazed. So amazed comes with a preposition at or it comes with to and verb. For example, I was amazed at her skills or I was amazed to find 20 um, golden coins in the old pot. That's it. And instead of saying very tired, it's better to say exhausted. Exhausted means very tired. After walking home all the way, I was really exhausted. I was really tired. Remember guys, we can use exhausted as a verb here, but as a verb means completely used up. For example, uh, yesterday when my students made a lot of noise in the class, my patience exhausted, which means my patience was over, finished. And instead of saying very pleased, it's better to say delighted. Again, guys, delighted comes with a preposition at or by, which comes with to and verb. So, for example, I was delighted at the news, or we can say, I was delighted to meet and see my old friend. So these are great, important and essential vocabularies you can use instead of very. Try to understand them and try to use them instead of saying very an adjective. I hope you have enjoyed this video. And don't forget to subscribe and like us. We will have more videos very soon. Goodbye.